This here is old Acom water softener building here in Wardell. Roof leaks now on it stuff and there's nothing going on. Right there in front of us is the Wardell Food Center. The only business in town that you buy a few things at. A few groceries. Not much there no more. That's our Wardell Volunteer Fire Department. That building there is what you call the Stoplight Cafe. Highway shed in our new city hall right there with the old one still standing every side of it. There's a little cafe that went out of business several years back. Baptist Church here in Wardell. The only funeral home we had was right there on that vacant spot where that truck was sitting and it burnt down and uh, actually it blew down by a tornado and now they went ahead and burned it and cleaned it up. Right over here is a school system here in Wardell, North Pemscott. They got a new shed here a few years back. We're going right on by it here now. New gym. And uh, actually the tornado tore the roof off it, but they since put it back. Look at there, there's a fella cutting grass on it. These are just a few of the old houses. My wife's nephew live in that one with the red and all speckled up there from the hailstorm. That place right here, me and my wife bought that thing new and lived there for about 20 something years and we finally sold it and moved out. We'll go down here and make a circle and come back through town. Oh, it's a plank, is that weird that's supposed to We're going to show you all we see here on the left side as we come back to town, headed back home. These school buses need to follow the school guidelines here and drive a little slower. i got one back here behind me that's trying to run over me. A and B Junction here at the stoplight in Wardell. That right there used to be called Bill White's Groceries. Old Jake Fisher put a station in there. This is our city bar right there. Some rental property where you store storage. That used to be one of the old cotton gins. Seed house. And there's a gin here in Wardell, Peterson's Gin Company. There is where the grain elevator for the Peterson Gin Company was. Farmer uses it now to store his beans. Coming up right here with this red pickup setting, that yellow building stuff used to be called Bill's Speed Shop. 
he sold everything from CB radios to three-wheelers to four-wheelers and satellites. That right there used to be called Bleason's uh, Hardware. We got all these small roads and things that leads back into where we live and stuff like that. Wish they would pave this road sometime. It gets muddy when it rains. over in there but I'm gonna go right around here and pick a friend of mine up and take him to Tennessee to get a cancer took off his nose today it's about uh, what time is it now it's about one o'clock so we're gonna have to get over there it's about 40 mile over there but he lives right here and we're gonna pick him up and take him to Diesburg to cancer doctor over there and get that taken off so I'll catch catch you guys later I'll film a little more and show you more around our town a little later on appreciate it uh, you can view one of my other YouTube videos uh, getting on down to the river just type out in YouTube there and you'll come across me